In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix Fortnite black screen on PC. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Fixing any problems attributed to running Fortnite on PC, including a black screen upon launch, is extremely simple. I'm gonna show you multiple methods, like I said, and the first one that usually solves this issue right away is to go over into your Epic Games Store Launcher, right-click Fortnite or click these little three dots, and then go into Manage. In here, verify the integrity of the game files. What this is going to do is scan all the files of your Fortnite installation by reading them, and if detects that any files are missing or corrupted, they are going to be reacquired. When they are reacquired, you will be able to launch the game again and see if this fixes the issue. If you are missing any critical files from the game to run, it won't load up properly without them. So doing this first ensures that the installation is properly done. If you verify the files and it still doesn't work, let's move on to the second method. Open up a web browser and look for Microsoft Visual C++ Redistributable, as you can see here on the official Microsoft website. Make sure that you visit this website specifically and you will be able to download all the recent versions of Visual Studio. You can also download older ones just to be safe and for most users you are going to be downloading this version here x64. However if your computer is not 64 bits and I can't guarantee you that it is you will have to download these old architectures here. As soon as you are done updating Microsoft Visual C++, you can also update DirectX. To do this, once again on the Microsoft website, look for DirectX and User Runtime. As always, download them from the original official site. Once you are finished updating these as necessary, see if the game runs, and if it still doesn't, let's move on to the last step. You can open the device manager on your computer by going over to the Windows icon, looking for device manager, and inside of here you can find the display adapters of your computer. You can see that I have an AMD GPU on my computer. If you have one, you can note down the name and update the drivers. You can also right click the actual display adapter here and update the driver from this window, however, I personally do not like doing this. If you have an integrated graphics card or display adapter, for example, an Intel integrated graphics, you can try right-clicking and updating the drivers. Alternatively, if you have an NVIDIA or AMD GPU like this, note down the model and visit the official NVIDIA or AMD website, where you can download the latest version of the drivers for your graphics card. So, as you saw, mine was a 7900 XTX, so the, on the AMD drivers page, I simply have to go into graphics, 7000 series, 7900, and then 7900 XTX. Once you update the graphics drivers, you have the latest version of Microsoft Visual C++ and DirectX, you will be able to make sure that Fortnite runs properly and you don't encounter any errors when trying to play it. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix Fortnite black screen. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.